Number 10. The Indian Red Scorpion. The India Red Scorpion, or the Eastern Indian Scorpion, is considered to be the most lethal scorpion in the world. It's fairly small, only ranging from 2 to 3.5 inches in length, but despite this, it packs quite a punch. Despite its name, it's not really that red. It ranges in color from bright reddish orange to dull brown, and the species has a distinctive dark gray ridge and granulation. Their pincers are relatively smaller compared to other scorpions, but they have really thick tails and a large stinger. Despite their potent venom, Indian red scorpions are kept as pets. They are also kept and bred in captivity for medical research. Scorpion toxins include potassium channel-blocking peptides, which may have used as immunosuppressants for autoimmune disorders such as multiple sclerosis and rheumatoid arthritis. Some toxins may have application in dermatology, cancer treatment, and as anti-malarial drugs. They are very common in India and Nepal, where stings from this species is unfortunately not uncommon. While the scorpions are not aggressive, they will sting when stepped on or otherwise threatened. The good news is that their stings are rarely fatal to adults, however children are more at risk. Number 9. The Funnel Web Spider Often positioned beneath rocks or logs in suburban gardens and bushland. Males are more active, especially after summer rain, when they begin to wander looking for females, and this is when people generally come into contact with them. Their venom is highly toxic and have various effects on humans, which include increased blood pressure, arrhythmia, coma, and death. The venom acts swiftly and is fatal within 15 minutes of the bite. Number 5. The Geographic Cone Snail You can't sometimes prevent yourself from touching the beautifully patterned shell of the Geographic Cone Snail. They live in the reefs of the Indo-Pacific regions where they usually hunt small fishes. The thin shell is pink, red, or white and is covered by thread-like strings. However, beneath this beautiful structure, there is a shocking truth. The cone snail has an incredible ability to detect prey swimming nearby. Once they recognize them, they use a needle-like growth from its mouth. It will then inject a type of venom into its prey. This venom is highly toxic and has some pain-killing properties as well. When this venom gets into you, it causes paralysis. The painlessness of the sting is most dangerous since the victim will not even be able to detect it. Now, these killing snails don't have humans on their to sting list, but it doesn't mean we're safe. They are a real threat to divers. In 2004 alone, around 30 human fatalities are reported due to cone snails. Number 10. Giraffe vs. Giraffe Everyone has seen giraffes fighting like those wind-dancing air puppets. This video, however, shows just how dangerous it can get. One of the animals successfully hits the other right in the base of the skull, giving it a concussion. The losing giraffe gets knocked out and falls to the ground like a tree. The fall to the ground looks equally painful. However, the giraffe soon recovers and lives to fight another day. Number 8. Cayman vs. Electric Eel This particular video shows a fight between an electric eel and a caiman that ends with disastrous consequences. The caiman snaps its jaws right around the throat of the eel, but it proves to be a really bad decision when the eel shocks the caiman with intensely high voltage for a really long duration. The caiman is not able to survive the shocks and dies an agonizing death. Number 7. Hippo vs. Crocodile This crocodile made a very poor choice when it decided to invade a group of over 30 hippos, including babies. The hippos immediately go into attack mode and swarm the crocodile in a sea of huge teeth and giant bodies. The crocodile seems to escape into the water but resurfaces and is eventually chased away by the watchful hippos. Hippopotamus Although at first glance this animal seems to be docile and calm, it proves to be the opposite. Being aggressive and becoming known for its unpredictable and extremely territorial behavior as well as having a tendency to attack humans by overturning boats and rafts. It is believed that it sees humans as a threat and that it does not like to share its waters, which has been evidenced in different confrontations against lions and even crocodiles, which it attacks with its big jaws, attacking or crushing everything in their path. Despite not being very athletic, weighing an average of 3,310 pounds and measuring about 5.2 feet, hippopotamus can run up to 19 miles per hour which is equivalent to the speed of an average human. In the same way, it is one of the animals with the highest number of human victims within the African continent. Don't let the round and tumbly nature of these animals fool you. While cute to look at, 
getting too close to a hippo might just be the last thing you do. Hippos kill more animals than any other mammal and are even known to attack crocodiles. Even large predatory animals like bears and sharks usually don't attack unless agitated or confused. But hippos are very territorial and will attack without any provocation. Whether you're up against a male hippo defending his territory or a female hippo protecting her calf, you're dealing with a 3,300 pound beast. This makes them very capable of capsizing and destroying entire boats filled with people. In Niger, a hippo flipped over a boat and killed 13 people. Cute as they may seem, approach these majestic creatures with caution. Number 4. Leopard versus Porcupine This video shows the lengths to which animals will go in their quest for survival. A leopard is attacking a porcupine. The porcupine acts defensively and presents its spine-covered back to the leopard for attack. The leopard, however, keeps attacking and in turn gets pierced by its long spines repeatedly. In the end, the porcupine succumbs to the attacks, but the leopard too bleeds to its death from its injuries. Number 1. Comedy of Errors In this bizarre clip, huge crocodiles in a crocodile sanctuary are being fed fishes. However, in their frenzy to feed, one of the crocodiles mistakenly bites another crocodile's arm and rips it off. It then proceeds to swallow the arm whole, much to the shock of the people watching. The crocodile who lost its arm, however, seems surprisingly calm. Thanks for watching and Number 9. Great White Shark If you ever saw the movie Jaws by Steven Spielberg, you know what animal we are talking about. Weighing between 1,500 to 2,450 pounds, measuring a length of around 20 feet, and being able to travel at a speed of 35 miles per hour, it is quite normal to feel afraid of this creature. Although contrary to popular belief, white sharks rarely attack humans. This is because it does not like the taste. Although it is still a threat because running into one is an indicator of bad news. It is believed that the shark usually bites something to recognize what it is, which would explain some attacks on boats or surfboards, and even the justification of why it would attack people. Although it could also be a disproportionate warning sign since their victims usually end up in terrible condition. Due to the fact that they usually inhabit areas close to the coast, sightings by bathers are frequent. It is estimated that in the last year, there were about 80 shark attacks worldwide, with only 5 fatalities. Number 1. Mosquito Considering the large number of fearsome animals mentioned in this top, mosquitoes would not go through our heads as one of the most dangerous. Although this animal does not kill directly, it is the carrier of hundreds of diseases and parasites that can eventually lead to death. Diseases that in the last decade have spread to different continents such as yellow fever, malaria, the Zika virus, and even dang, the most common within these insects. It is estimated that more than 725,000 people die every year from diseases transmitted by mosquitoes. It is even believed that this animal could even be more lethal than human beings themselves. While African rhinos are fighting against extinction to survive, it's still important to stay on your guard if you get to see one in the wild. As peaceful as they look, rhinos can have a bit of a temper, and when provoked, their reactions can be unpredictable. The main reason behind their aggressiveness is their rather poor eyesight. They easily get confused and attack anything they may perceive as a threat. An adult rhino can weigh in at 6,000 pounds and they'll charge with full force to kill or injure anything they deem to be dangerous or annoying. Never get in between a mother and her baby or anywhere near an older male, because as fascinating as they may be, you do not want to be on the receiving end of one of those horns. Number eight, honey badger. The honey badger is the only animal on this list that's not a significant threat to humans. But nevertheless, it deserves to be here. 
The honey badger is well known for its aggression and will take on any opponent far larger than itself, including lions. Whether going up against a cobra or a cape buffalo, they are the ultimate brawlers and if cornered, they will fight to the death. Their thick skin makes them resilient to most attacks, such as bee stings, porcupine quills, and animal bites. Even deadly snake venom would merely put a honey badger to sleep for a while, only to wake up with a bit of a hangover and get on with his day. So, if you wouldn't mess with a snake or a lion, you should definitely steer clear of the honey badger. Baboons aren't exactly the most peaceful monkeys on the planet. With their bad attitudes and razor-sharp canines, they're some of the most aggressive animals you'll ever encounter. According to specialist Robert Sapolsky, a baboon troop is the textbook example of a highly aggressive, male-dominated, hierarchical society, and they're constantly duking it out with each other. While there are no known incidents of baboons attacking people, the last thing you want to do is smile at one. Male baboons may view this action as a sign of aggression and can mock charge you, sometimes only backing off a few inches away. Baboons have also been known to open car doors on safari and ransack the vehicles for food. And they can fight aggressively to defend what they've taken. Number five, black mamba. While most venomous snakes tend to flee or hide, the black mamba has been known to be more unpredictable. Not only can its venom kill a human in as little as seven hours, but it's also very fast. Having been recorded at speeds of 6.8 miles per hour. Although it's not the most venomous snake, its propensity for aggression still makes it one of the most feared on the planet. When threatened, it can raise its head well off the ground and throw as much as 40% of its body upwards, enabling it to strike a human's chest. Despite their reputation for aggression and death, they are not the deadly snake in Africa. That title goes to the oscillated Carper Viper. Even so, it's easy to see why you wouldn't want to cross a black mamba. Number four, cassowaries. The cassowary looks like a one big prehistoric turkey and has a hell of an attitude. Adults can grow to be nearly seven feet tall and weigh up to 170 pounds. While their size is second only to ostriches, cassowary attacks are known to be far deadlier. When provoked, they become extremely aggressive and attack viciously using their powerful legs and sharp claws as primary weapons. With one blow using these claws, they can even break the bones of a human. Few birds convey a don't mess with me vibe as effectively as a cassowary. Just look at this picture of a scientist holding the claw of a male southern cassowary. Just in case you still needed convincing that birds are living dinosaurs amongst us. Number three, polar bear. If you were out on the ice and see a polar bear, it's too late. He's probably been stalking you for hours. The largest meat eater living on land. Polar bears are extremely protective of their cubs and attack viciously when there is a perceived threat. They are the largest bears on earth with males growing up to weigh around 700 kilograms. With all that force, a polar bear can cut off a human head with a swipe of its paw. While they don't seek out confrontations, if they're really hungry or feel threatened, they'll hunt, kill, and eat. A human without a second thought. As they say about bears, if it's black, attack. If it's brown, stay down. If it's white, Good night. Number two, Tosa Inu dog. 
The Tose Inu dog is a Japanese Mastiff. Bred to be a massive dog fighting machine. It should be no surprise then that animal aggression is a serious issue. Tosas are fearless protectors of the people they love. But if they perceive something as a threat, they will attack it without hesitation. Tosas can display predatory behavior, actively hunting cats, small dogs, and any animal that runs. A Tosa Inu is generally not supposed to be aggressive towards people, but the size and athleticism of this breed make them one huge responsibility. There are very few people who can and should want to own a Tosa, as they need to be kept under control at all times. Perhaps if you want a dog to participate in the sport of weight pulling, seeing as Tosas can pull more than 3,000 pounds, how many people can handle a dog who can pull more than 3,000 pounds? The answer is no one. This breed cannot be outmuscled. Before we reveal number one, be sure to check out other amazing videos on our channel and give us a like if you enjoyed this video so far. Also, tell us in the comments which one of these is most beautiful according to you. Number one, Tasmanian Devil. This fierce creature is found only in the Australian island state of Tasmania. They earn the name Devil for being prone and very quick to become aggressive. They display a frightening appearance by showing their teeth and screeching very loudly. An unprovoked Tasmanian Devil won't attack humans, but this fearless creature won't hesitate to take a bold move to defend himself. Don't be fooled by their size, as Tasmanian Devils has the most powerful bite relative to body size of any living mammalian carnivore. Scary poses aside, the Tasmanian Devil actually uses one other weapon to avoid initial confrontation. When threatened, they produce a foul smell in an attempt to get rid of the danger. With all those devilish features combined, it's no surprise how they got the name.